First Lady of San Diego swapped out her little black dress for coveralls and a welder's mask. Catherine Stewart Faulkner's name will now be a part of history. San Diego 6's Jenny Day was there as she etched her initials into a steel plate that will be attached to a tanker. Hey, good afternoon, guys. Safety first. And the city's first lady was a trooper today. And now she's a part of this massive ship. They're building it right now. It's a well-oiled machine here. And now she's a part of history. And this all contributes to our nation's economy. And right now, they are hiring even more people. There's a saying that behind every great man, there is a woman rolling her eyes. After a quick wardrobe change, gloves check, mask check, a quick love tap of support from the doting husband, it was time to weld. Three practice rounds, then the real deal. KSF, Catherine Stewart Faulkner. I think I have a little bit more training I need to do before I really uh, pursue this. The First Lady of San Diego will forever be a part of the Lone Star State, Hole 551. I told Catherine, I'm sure they'll just make you wear a hat or something real quick. <laughs> Uh, she's a trooper. <laughs> the Keel Lang ceremony is an important milestone in the life of a ship and is a long tradition in the American shipbuilding industry. American shipbuilding is alive and well in this country, and San Diego is leading the way. General Dynamics NASCO employs 3,800 people. You know about the welders, you know about the, the, the pipe fitters, but there's scaffold, there's temp services, there is an array of positions, accounting. I come from the accounting background. 300 more positions are open right now. Christina Ramirez has been an employee for 15 years. I love my job. I've never been happier. I call it my God-given job. That's a true story. And ask the First Lady, no experience needed. People come in here with no experience at all, none. And they teach them, you know, put them through eight weeks of welding school, and then they have the opportunity to move up to management, and it's truly the American dream here. We were given a tour of the five ships that are quickly taking shape. These 610 foot long, 50,000 ton tankers will carry fuel, chemicals, cars, food, all to support U.S. industries. We want to see a product at the end of the day that is complete and that they can walk away from and be proud of. San Diego workmanship, San Diego pride, we love it. A ship this size takes about 14 months to build, which is pretty fast. So in just a couple of months, they will christen it, and then it will sail away in November. Again, this is the only full-service um, shipyard on the West Coast, and they are hiring. We're live downtown, Jenny Day, San Diego 6 News.